I'm Coyote Peterson, and I just had an animal encounter that's gonna knock your socks off. Get ready to see the largest freshwater turtle in North America. The waterlogged landscapes of the south provide a rich and protected environment for a plethora of species. Today the crew and I are exploring a private preserve in Homestead, Florida. Whether traveling by airboat over the saturated fields of sawgrass or trudging through on foot, one thing is for certain. This is one seriously unforgiving habitat. Watch out for the moccasins. On this particular morning, we were looking for one of the preserve's rarest resident reptiles. This turtle is kept in a confined area, but finding him amongst the plants and mud is far easier said than done. Sadly, their numbers have greatly decreased over the past quarter century, and they are now protected throughout the range in the southeastern United States. And although this species doesn't naturally occur in the Florida Everglades, the environment was a perfect backdrop for a creature that is considered an ancient legend of folklore myth. Now, let's just sneak up slow on this and try not to startle anything that might be out. Uh, yeah, there could be alligators, so just uh, be aware. Something. Hey, hey, something's moving right here. Hold on. Keep up, keep up. Move it, move it, move it. It's a turtle. It's huge. It is huge. It's an alligator snapping turtle. Hold on, let me bring it back around this way. Wow. Can you believe the size of that turtle? Holy cow. Wow. Whoa, 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 there, buddy. Oh my goodness. I saw these plants moving. He started to bury down. Look at the size of him. And man, is he powerful. There's no doubt about it. This is the biggest turtle I have ever captured. Woo, look at that head. Jeez, he's trying to get my face in his mouth. Holy cow, this can be a 100 pound turtle. Look at that swamp beast. My goodness, what an absolute dinosaur. Wow, look at that mouth. My entire fist could fit inside there. And yeah, you would not want to get your hand caught in the mouth of this turtle. Let's see if I can get him to put his head up a little bit for us. Up here, buddy. Wow, look at that. Have you ever seen something so prehistoric? Look at those eyes, those eyes are just beautiful. Now, one of the easy ways to quickly identify an alligator snapping turtle which as soon as I jumped into the water, I knew it was an alligator snapping turtle because of these three large ridges that run along the top of the carapace. Now, carapace is at the top of the shell. Now, common snapping turtles, the cousin to this species, does not have these distinct ridges. So the plastron, which is the bottom of the shell, on snapping turtles is quite a bit smaller than other turtle species. And the way you can tell whether it's a male or a female is that the males have a slightly concave shell and females have slightly convex shell. So this is a big boy. The males usually have tails that are quite a bit longer than the females as well. And I can also kind of see that he has some turtle parts. That is a huge turtle. That is a very, very big turtle. Actually, there was a story in Kansas in 1937 of a 405 pound alligator snapping turtle. I'm guessing this guy's probably around 100 pounds. So if you can imagine something almost four times this size, you really are talking about a dinosaur. So now the moment of truth to find out how much this turtle weighs. Uh, I found a pretty good stick that I think is going to support the weight of the turtle. I'm going to use my pack to build a harness, tie him in, and then I'm going to, I think, need your help, Mark, to hoist him up. I'm going to guess that this turtle is somewhere between 70 and 100 pounds. One, two, three, up. Oh my gosh. That is a heavy turtle. Just at about 90 pounds for this alligator snapping turtle. Uh, a few more fish eaten, and this guy is gonna break the century mark. Every time we encounter an animal, we like to make sure we are as gentle as possible. And right now, he's just basically wanting to get back out into the water. This is, you know, a slightly stressful situation for him, but I just try to keep him calm and enjoy their company for the moment. And I really wanted to catch this turtle and bring it up onto shallower water so you guys could have the experience of being up close and personal with one of the most ancient creatures on our planet. Wow, what an unbelievable encounter 
with the largest freshwater turtle in North America, the alligator snapping turtle. Now I'm sure that you guys have plenty of questions for me about this swamp beast. So leave me comments below and let's talk alligator snapping turtles. Personal best for me. I don't know if I'll ever catch another turtle this big. I'm Coyote Peterson. Be brave, stay wild. We'll see you on the next adventure. You ready to head back out there and catch some fish? All right, I'll walk him over here, deeper water. All right, and off he goes. See you later, big guy. If you thought that was one wild adventure, check out these other animal encounters. And don't forget, subscribe to follow me and the crew on this season of Breaking Trail.